Now it just gets yes, real indeed. every weekend. <laughs> you know full well that you, jo you join us every week to mm -hmm. celebrate those who are celebrating. So with so much pleasure, we welcome you to another edition of Metrofile on your award-winning station, Channels Television. Of course, where would you rather be if not with us on Metrofile? We promise it's going to be a fantastic edition. Yeah. And before we get started, though, remember some of the images you might be seeing on the show today might contain flash photography. I'm Anne Mwawadu. And I'm Oge Chukwosi. Welcome to the show. Now, we'll start off the show right here in Lagos, where we join others to celebrate the former deputy governor of Lagos State. I'm talking about Princess Sarah at DBC Shoson as she turns the big 60. The birthday girl, Princess Sarah at DBC Shoson, looking all glamorous as she arrives to Cathedral Church of Christ Marina acknowledging warm embrace from the guests who have taken time out on a weekday to celebrate this joyful day with her and her family. Special service to mark her 60th birthday got underway. For an event taking place on a weekday, the turnout of people says a lot about the celebrant who was a former deputy governor of Lagos State. Some of the dignitaries who grace the event include the Deputy Governor of Ogo State, Yetunde Ononuga, wife of the Governor of Oyo State, Florence Ajimobi, the wife of the Lagos State Governor, Bolanle Ambode, the wife of the former Governor of Lagos State, Mrs. Abimbola Fashola, the wife of the former Governor of Ekiti State, Mrs. Bisi Fayemi, business mogul, Mrs. Falorosho Alakija, the MD of Guardian Newspapers, Mrs. Maiden Ibru, President of LCCI, Chief Nike Akonde, APC Woman Leader, Mrs. Kemi Nelson, the President of Trade Promotion Board, Michael Olawale Cole, and wife, former Attorney General of Lagos State, Mr. Shukwo Shashore, Royal Fathers, among other important guests. The celebration continued on the dance floor as a celebrant steps forward for a special Thanksgiving. loving and uh, wherever she puts her mind in anything she's determined she sees that she does it she's a very kind person she's extremely supportive wherever you are where, um, however you might um, be she's always there for you as a friend I wish that God would continue to use her she'll continue to influence the society positively and she'll continue to mentor the younger ones and most especially in education what is different about the age, more experience, wisdom, and the way you do a lot of things you need to change. Like, I have decided that um, I get provoked easily. I have prayed to God that I want to take things very easy. Close my eyes sometimes when it's necessary because I get irritated when people behave badly. And when 
you know what you are supposed to do right and you are not doing it. The celebrant, who was also in charge of the Lagos State Ministry of Education during her time as Deputy Governor, wants more attention to be paid to the sector. I want to just enjoy the federal government to reach out. There's still a lot to be done, especially at the primary school, early childhood. Nothing is happening there and we still need a lot to do. Basically, my mom is the most awesome person in this world. She has been with me even through trying times. After the service, her close friends were hosted to a little reception. It did not take long for her to hit the dance floor, joined by her friends. Dance to the cake stand to cut the cake. Princess Sarah Adebisi Shoson OFR was born on the 11th of February 1956. She hails from Irewa Town or Joe Local Government, Badagri Division, Lagos State. She is married to a retired Navy commander, Ulusei Shoson, and their marriage is blessed with children. Here is wishing her many more years ahead. Oh,